What sets Port Antonio apart from other destinations is its authenticity, especially when it comes to hanging out in Boston Bay. Around here, you can forget about chain restaurants or boring hotel dining. Boston Bay is the birthplace of authentic Jamaican jerk. Down here, jerk is cooked right in front of you, on wood, over an open flame. It's hot, and I gotta warn you, it's spicy, and you can smell it over a mile away. But when you're done eating, you can continue down to the ocean for a picnic and a bit of entertainment. That's because Boston Bay also boasts one of the Caribbean's best surfing spots. Here the surfing season lasts a full eight months, and it's considered one of the best places to learn how to surf, since the waves are small and consistent. So don't be surprised if you get recruited for a lesson. And while you're in Boston Bay, Another thing you'll want to do is pick up some souvenirs. But trust me, don't hit the gift shops. Instead of taking home the obligatory t-shirt, how boring is that, or any other predictable souvenir, there are plenty of opportunities in Port Antonio to get your hands dirty. For a truly authentic souvenir, go to Fairy Hill Paper Factory near Boston Bay. <laughs> Gloria Dorman, or Miss G, as she's called, and protege Julia Smith get you up close and personal on the little known art of how to create handmade paper. Oh, it's not clean at all, but in really doing it, it's a joy. Fairy Hill Paper Factory has been a mainstay of the community for more than 20 years. The factory provides employment and skills training for women in the area. They use recycled paper and plant fibers, and the women here create a variety of paper products, including greeting cards, note cards, and envelopes. Not only will you learn about the process of making recycled paper products, but you'll also be helping support the tiny community of Fairy Hill. Thank you very much. I'm Peter Greenberg, and thanks for watching.